Hey, what's up, Super? It's me, Blue Runner Twenty. Over at Going Twenty, and today, um, we're gonna open this blister that I bought at my local Toys R Us. So, um, before I open this, um, I did buy two additional ones of these, and um, I bought six packs of Plasma Storm at my um, local Target, and I was looking at certain YouTubers and um, they were saying about um how to like weigh the packs and all that. Um, unfortunately I didn't have a scale, but, um, I just did it at a free fall with my hand, and I started, um, weighing all the other packs, and trying to similarize the weights, which one weighed heavier, and I opened three of the six that I bought at the local Target, and, um, I do apologize not to showing it, but, um, I did it off camera, because I couldn't wait, I wanted to see if, if it actually would work, and it would be, like, worth the other three packs to be worth um opening like in public but um what I without further ado um I'm very happy about this I pulled a Articuno full art very nice car um uh, my first full art for the plasma gale I mean um plasma storm sorry plasma store set um I finally have a um Sorry about that. A EX full art. Um, like I mentioned, I did sell my um, Garatina um, full art and my Dark Cry full art on eBay, like probably like a month or two ago. So uh, I'm very happy that I have another. I uh, have uh, a full art to put on my collection. So we put this on in the background. Very nice card. Well, if I do, we'll open this. Um, the front has pl um, platinum. I'm not too sure what the other three packs are. So, what I do, we'll open it. So, just to let you know, in my next video, um, I entered um, Tadashi Studios uh, pack opening battle royale. So I'm thinking of opening the other three plasma gales, which will be after this video, um, and use that as an entry to my um, my battle royale. So stay tuned for that. Okay, so we have of course the platinum. Oh, we have a supreme victors. Nice. We have a Pikachu promo. So I have another one, and then a rising rivals. Nice. So at my local um Toys R Us, they also had, um, besides the blisters, they had um Platinums, Rising Rivals. They had Rising Rivals, Supreme Victors. They had um, Legend Awakens, Diamond Pro Legend Awakens, Stormfront. Um, of course the tins. They had a lot of pretty old stuff, so um, I was pretty happy about it. Pretty excited. So let me just leave this. Pikachu. Sorry about the weight. And by the way, um, this will be a segment of completing the level X's because I'm pretty sure that there's level X's in these sets. Sorry about that. Let me just quickly skim through and see if they actually do have level X's. Okay, yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so this will be a segment of Chasing Level X's. So this will be part four. Um, my last video, it was the Pokia tin, I believe. Yeah, it was the Pokia tin. So that will, that was the third one. So, without further ado, we're going to go from... I think all this to newest. I'm not sure if Rising Rivals because I don't have a, a card list for that. So I put that as last because Supreme Victor is the main card that I would want. It's a Charizard. So we're going to start with the Platinum first. And this is with the Pokia in front. So these, unfortunately, I cannot. I ain't, wasn't able to weigh it. But no matter what, um, I don't really have these cards in a set. So it would be nice to collect the platinum especially since I'm chasing for the level X's in general so yeah let's 
to open it. Go and put that inside. Sorry about that. So one, two, three. One, two. Put these at the front. Okay. Oh, nice. Oh, let's see if we can focus. There you go. So we have a Helm Doom G. Survivor. Galactic HQ. Oh, Tauros. Nice. Combi, Swablu, Skitty, Marip, which looks like a um, Play-Doh or like a like a um, molded version of it. Reverse. Oh, nice. We got a rare um, sh um, Shaman. That's nice. And for the rare, we have a Blitz Blitzel. Okay, so. Two rares, pretty nice, pretty nice. Let me see this shame in it. So we go with the Rising Rival with a scissor. So I really don't know what. What's in the Rising Rivals? I think I opened a few packs before. So I'm not too sure what it's in there. So pretty, I'm gonna be pretty surprised what's in gonna be in that set. So, so I'm hoping to at least get a level X in this blister. So okay. So one, two, three. Front. Oh, nice. Okay, let's focus them. Okay, so we have a Rapidash. Oh, Flint's Rapidash. There you go. Flint's Willpower. Oh, nice. Machamp GL. Snorlax. Nice. Oh, nice. A Quaxar GL. A Ambipom G. Oh, very nice. Much legs. Uh, Hippopotas. For the reverse, we have a Lairon, which is a uncommon. And for the rare, a Mawa GL. So still no hollow, but I did get a rare, double rare. So let's see this. Um, they run up. Um, by the way, um, put if you want, leave in the comments down below, and I'll um, mention if you consider completing a set, like like a big um, black and white one, dominant pros, supreme victors. Do you consider a complete set, regulars, and reverses, or just regular, or just regular? Cause um. Personally, I think, and I feel, that just doing a regular version without the reverses is a complete set for me. But um, I'm pretty interested in hearing you guys mention um, whether or not. And by the way, um, FYI, if you guys ask in the, message, in the comments below um, if um, for me to give you code cards, unfortunately, I do not do that. I do it only on giveaways. Um, the reason why is that not only um, it's a good way to it's a good um, prize for giveaways, but um, I see it as um, how could I say it? I see it as um, a way just to like give something to the community. I don't want to just give it to one person, or if you ask multiple times, I'll give it to you. I don't think that's fair. I don't think also when um, they give codes, the first one that gets it gets the code. I don't believe in that. I think everybody should deserve a chance and put it on a raffle. So um, I apologize ahead of time and just, just join the raffle and possibly you'll win. 
So um, without further ado, we'll open this um, Supreme Vectors with a card chomp. So one, two, three, to the front. All right. Okay, so we have a Cynthia's Guidance. Oh, nice. A Manetra G. A Ninja Ask. Oops. Sorry about that. Okay. Oh, Pikachu, nice. A Corefish. A Mudkip. Zubat. Beldum. For the reverse, we have a Staravia, which is a reverse. And for the rare, oh man. Uh, nice! A Blazer King FB level X. So, um, great way to um, finish the the opening with a level X. So, of course, this is in my collection. I'm trying to see if there's scratches. I've seen a couple pulls like this, and they had like min minimal scratches. It looks pretty mint to me. Some edge wear expected, but it's definitely near mint. So nice. Very, very happy about this. So let me just sleeve, quickly sleeve this. It's already 12 minutes already. I don't like spending too much time on a video. I've been doing that very, very often. So for the reverses, we have a Storavia. The... Later on, in the shaman rail. For the reverses, we, I mean, for the rares, we have a Monwa GL and a um, Blissey. And then, of course, the main pull, the best pull, Blazy King FB Level X. So, very happy. I'll leave you with this. Um, stay tuned for the next video with the entry of Tadashi Studios Battle Royale. Later.